Hello friends and family from Universal City Walk. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to head on over to the main Universal Studios store here on City Walk. You don't need a park ticket or anything like that to actually come to City Walk. We're going to check out all of the awesome Wizarding World of Harry Potter merchandise that they have to offer us today at the main Universal Studios store. So many amazing offerings and collectibles I'm going to show you guys today. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click the bell notification so you aware of future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. That is a fun little fact here with Universal City Walk. Actually, you don't need a park ticket at all. You can just enjoy the uh, restaurants that they have to offer on City Walk and do all of the shopping that they have on City Walk as well, which is really just incredible. All right, let's head on into the Universal Studios store here on City Walk and actually check out all of the Harry Potter offerings they have. So as soon as you come in, they actually have a bunch of really nice hats. These are Hufflepuff Captain Quidditch. These are $27. They do have a really nice Hufflepuff Keeper hat with the embroidered over there. Look at that, like that there is really cool. The uh, Badger, these are $27 as well. They do have those in all houses. So like you have your uh, Slytherin Quidditch Captain, your Slytherin Keeper, and they do have some really awesome shirts right over here for Quidditch. The Hufflepuff 07 is $40. And then they also have Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and Gryffindor. They also have a whole selection of really amazing athletic wear. I do want to start over here with Hufflepuff and then so on. They have this full zip sweatshirt here, $65. It's actually like a uh, like a dry fit material, which is really nice. They have some Hufflepuff cups. These are $27 a piece, and I do like those a lot. Like, those are really cool. And I strongly suggest you guys check out the drinkware. They do have these for all of the houses. They say Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Like, this is a really thick, heavy plastic. Those are $12 a piece. And they do have some really cool steins of all of the houses as well. $30 a piece for these. Like I was saying though, they do have all of that same merchandise in every single house. Like over here we have the uh, Slytherin section, then we have the Gryffindor section, which is really just beautiful merchandise. I do want to point out the magic brooms you could actually purchase here. These are $34.95 and they actually light up blue on the tips. Like that is a really fun little take home. That's really neat. For $25, you can actually take home your very own Triwizard Tournament Cup. And these actually light up, which is really fun. They have some Golden Snitch toys. These are $20 a piece only. The packaging is just incredible. The wings actually flutter, and it does come with a base. A pretty darn good deal there for $20, actually. And there's even a, a Golden Snitch game down here. They have some really fun 4x6 photo frames of Hogwarts Castle there. Like these are just awesome, very, very heavy. And you actually get the, like the Hogwarts Castle sculpture. These will run you yeah, $26.95 for those. And they even have some really fun Hogwarts Castle snow globes, $48.95. But all of the snow actually just falls down on Hogwarts Castle. Like that is just so beautiful. There's also some really fun offerings of Hogwarts drinkware. This is actually a coffee mug, $21 for this. Pretty darn good in size. And look at the back of it. Actually has says Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Like that there is really neat. And I want to show you guys like the uh, larger glasses that they have over here. Like these are very, very tall. Again, with the Hogwarts houses, you can actually see them all like etched in. It says Wizarding World of Harry Potter. $19 for this one only. They do have small backpacks for all of the houses. These are $65 a piece. These aren't lounge fly or anything, but you get a really fuzzy like a uh, colored ball there that matches the houses. This actually has the Ravenclaw house crest, a very small backpack, but these are great for the parks actually. Over here is the Hufflepuff one. And then they also have a Slytherin and Gryffindor over there, but I do want to point out the awesome spirit jerseys that they have. Like these are incredible, $70 a piece. Like these are very, very lightweight. This one's the Hufflepuff one. The top half is black and then you have the classic yellow. And then on the back of this is actually embroidered Hufflepuff. Like these are very, very good quality spirit jerseys for the price, 70 bucks a piece for these. But like I said, they do have those over here in Ravenclaw. Then they have Gryffindor and Slytherin spirit jerseys. But here's the, uh, the Gryffindor and Slytherin backpacks. 
They have some awesome new Harry Potter plushies. These are teddy bears. It's embroidered on the paw there. Harry Potter, and he's actually wearing Harry's Christmas sweater. Like this is awesome. Very, very amazing. These are only $40 a piece actually. Like these are very large in size. I'm surprised at the price of those guys. And check out this women's v-neck with the Hogwarts house crest. These are $37 a piece. For $45, they have a really awesome, like, double-sided pillow. It says platform nine and three quarters on the one side, and then the other side is actually embroidered with Hogwarts railways. A very, very soft, like, velvety. Like, that is awesome. Over here, a platform nine and three quarters t-shirt. This is adult size. These are $37. And on the sleeve, it actually says platform nine and three quarters. But check out these ginormous Hogwarts Express Steins. This is probably one of the biggest ones I've seen. $39.95. That there is worth every penny though. They also have a whole setup over here with some really awesome items for the kitchen table. I do want to show you these bowls. They actually say Hogwarts in the uh, center there with all the Hogwarts houses. And then you have like Slytherin, a Hufflepuff. Over there we have Gryffindor and then Ravenclaw. $17 a piece for those guys. Again, a very heavy ceramic. And they do have matching salt and pepper shakers. $12 a piece for these. Like that there is not really that bad of a deal at all. And then some Time Turner uh, Christmas ornaments. They actually spin just like the one in the movie and the ones from the Noble Collection. $24 a piece for these. This pillow over here is just awesome. It's an Albus Dumbledore quote for $29. We all must face the choice between what is right and what is easy Albus Dumbledore like these pillows are very soft like I'm a sucker for anything Albus Dumbledore so that there is just awesome then they have some coffee mugs happiness can be found even in the darkest of times if only remembers to turn on the light Albus Dumbledore $21 for these these Wizarding World of Harry Potter backpacks are actually $98 these aren't lounge fly but they are very very nice like I love the quilted pattern the embroidery on here this is the Griffin door one they have Slytherin right over here Ravenclaw and then Hufflepuff but they also have some really fun matching fanny packs which are perfect for the parks $68 a piece for these but again they have these in all four houses as well there's also some really fun wooden wall signs for Hogwarts over here, School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. I do like all of the gold accents on there. Like these are really neat. And check out the platform nine and three quarters. Like this is like a tin sign, like almost you'd find like in a barn or something like that. I love this sign. That there is just way cool. And then they do have these little boxes with all four houses. Like these are just like little wooden boxes that say Ravenclaw. These are $24 a piece. There's even some really cool puzzles. This is a thousand piece puzzle set with Dobby. I do want to check out some of the other offerings. These actually are awesome. Okay, these are Diagon Alley prop signs. It looks like you actually can make all five of the puzzles. These are, let's see here, 200 pieces each in total of a thousand. These are really neat though. There's actually all five of the different um, Diagon Alley prop signs you can actually get, like shop signs I should say, like that there is really cool. And you have the uh, Gringotts Bank Escape thousand piece puzzle. I'm not sure of the price on these, they're not listed, but these are really neat. For $10.95, you can actually purchase your Hogwarts Express ticket. One side is Hogwarts to London, then your other side is actually London to Hogwarts. I do like those. And check out some of the women's like uh, little bags here that they actually have. Like this is a perfect little clutch to actually just wear in the parks. Like this one here is $20. Then I want to show you the one right next door over here. It actually says Hogwarts to London. Look at the inside though. It's actually a pretty good size card holder another good item for the parks these are only $28 a piece also another new t-shirt from Weasley Wizard Wheezes this one's $35 I do want to show you the back of this look at this though you have you know poo puking pastels the uh, skiving snack box look at that though range of sweets to make you ill I love the uh, puking pastels though and of course, if you want to purchase some Wizarding World of Harry Potter candies, they have Birdie Bots Every Flavored Beans. These are $13 a piece. The packaging is incredible on all Wizarding World of Harry Potter candy. They do have the Birdie Bots in the uh, collectible tins as well. What I like about these though, it's a really fun take home. Like you can't really break it and it comes with a fun tassel. Those are $25. And of course, Dumbledore's favorite, you have the uh, Lemon Drops and the uh, Honey Dukes container. These are $25 a piece. 
It actually looks like they're having a deal. Buy one, get one free on the uh, Fainting Fancies. These are orange and lemon fruit gummies. Originally $6.95. You could actually buy one of these, get one free, which is a really good deal. They have some chocolate covered fudge flies. These are a lot of fun. I've actually had these before. Like these are really, really good. And they have the peppermint toads. Very delicious. If you guys ever tried Andy's mints, these kind of taste like those. These are about $10.95, but very, very good snacks. For $82, they have this really fun uh, lounge fly bag. It's actually the Niffler from Fantastic Beast and Where to Find Them. I love this though because it has like all necklaces that the Niffler took. Actually like a little purse over there. And on the side it actually says Fantastic Beast and where to find them. These are $82 a piece. Very, very nice they are. And how adorable are the uh, baby Niffler plushies that they have for Fantastic Beast. $18 a piece. It does look like we have three different offerings actually hanging out over here on this shelf. Look at this one though. Kind of reminds me of uh, Gizmo from Gremlins. For $70, they have this long sleeve Wizarding World of Harry Potter um, Deathly Hollow symbol shirt. Like, this is very fancy for a nice dinner. That is really neat. And then they have this one over here. It's actually a pullover sweatshirt, again, with the uh, Deathly Hollow symbol. These ones are $55, and it's actually like really, really thin. Definitely perfect for like uh, fall and uh, spring weather. You can also get a uh, matching Deathly Hollows cup over here for your coffee. I love the handle on this guy. $21 for him. It does look like they have many offerings though for the Deathly Hollows over here for $45. They do have a really good size women's wallet which is very neat. And then they have like a smaller size leather backpack again with the Deathly Hollow symbol on the side there. And then you have a ginormous one on the front. $65 for that but I do want to point out like this very, very large size leather one, again with the uh, Deathly Hollow symbol, $75. I really like this though. Very large size again for the uh, theme parks. And you could also get a matching pillow here, $35. Very, very soft though. Of course, you can also purchase all of your wizard robes. These are $139 for the adult sizes. They go from four extra small all the way up to two or three X. So definitely check and make sure that your size is here. But they do have over here at this particular location on City Walk, like all of the different houses, like you have Slytherin. Over here, you have your Ravenclaw. Hufflepuff is over there, but I absolutely love these backpacks up here. Like, look at these. They almost look like lunch boxes. That is so cool. Let's see here. They are $88 a piece. You have like a Ravenclaw tie. They are really neat though. They also have a huge collection of cabinetry items over here from the uh, Noble Collection Harry Potter. Over here you have the Mirror of Erised, $95. And you have that ginormous, like this is amazing, from Harry Potter, the Escape from Gringotts. You have the Gringotts Bank with the dragon, $495 for that guy. But again, all of these are Noble Collection items, very, very high quality. Very good items. I love the Dobby sculpture with the uh, book and he's holding the sock for $120. And you can actually get the Triwizard Tournament wand set. It comes with the whole case actually. And if you look on the bottom, it actually says Triwizard Champions. These are $195, but you get Harry, Cedric Diggory, Floor, and uh, Victor Crumb. Up here, there's actually a really fun Basilisk book and that's again Noble Collection, $58. You have the Noble Collection Lucius Malfoy mask with wall mount for $160. The attention to detail on these items though is really just second to none. Like you have uh, Professor Slughorn's hourglass for $160. But this is probably one of the newer items that I don't think I've personally owned before. They have the dark mark wall mount with all of the uh, Death Eater wands. That one there is $250. Even the uh, Ravenclaw diadems down here, it comes in that very, very fancy Ravenclaw box, $165. There's just so many amazing offerings. Over here are some really fun Slytherin leather bound books and actually has like a really awesome like metallic Slytherin house crest. These are $25 a piece. And everything I show you, they do have in every single house. They have a Slytherin ink pen. These are only $5 actually. So that there's actually a pretty darn good deal for only five bucks. Let's see what else they have over here. Some Ravenclaw bookmarks. Oh, that one's actually really neat. I like that one. That one is $9.95. And you could even get your very own Ravenclaw wax seal kit where you can get your stamper and then your two wax seals. Let's see. Yeah, those are really neat. 
These bags here are actually really good for the beach or going to the pool. This is the Ravenclaw one where it says wisdom, learning, and wit. Those are $45. Like I was saying, they do have like the Hufflepuff version, patience, uh, dedication, loyalty. And also check out the different house banners that they have. Again, with those sayings. And everything on here is embroidered. Like very, very good quality. They even have some tassels at the bottom. Like I love these a lot. For $18.95, you can get your very own howler. And look at that. This is what it looks like inside just like the movies and it records your own voice as well it's a pop-up card like I like that a lot and they have a, a matching like howler purse for women these are $79 a piece very very neat though very unique to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter and check out this women's tank top that they have actually it's in it's like all uh, gold lettering it says waiting for my letter these are $35 a piece then for $82 to actually have a Hedwig lounge fly. And look at that, it actually has like the uh, seal there on the envelope. On the side it says Harry Potter lounge fly. I love the uh, Hedwig, the eyes really pop on this. And all of the uh, stars, but look at the back. Like that is incredible with the uh, Hogwarts on the back of this. $82, that there is not too shabby. Then they have a long sleeve shirt right over here. It looks like a pajama shirt. You got Hedwig, $37 with all of like the uh, gold leafing. They also have many different pin offerings. This one's a Slytherin one for $8, but they have Slytherin, Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff, and down here, these ones are a little bit more ornate, like the pewter work and then the sparklies. These ones are only $12 a piece, but there are some really interesting, like different ones in here that I wanna show you guys. Like look at this Gryffindor one. Determination, courage, bravery. They have Slytherin, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff. And let's see what else that they have over here. Like this is one with all of the uh, Hogwarts houses. It says Hogwarts on the bottom. This one is $10. For $9, they have this one. I solemnly swear I'm up to no good. It says Mischief Managed. They have a really fun one with a chocolate frog. This opens up. You can actually see the uh, chocolate frog in there. This is really heavy. Let's see here. $15 for the chocolate frog. They have uh, Horace Slughorn's Hourglass, which you actually purchase over there in the uh, Noble Collection section. This one here is only $15. Of course, you can't forget to get your very own chocolate frogs. These are three for $35. They do come with the uh, collector's box and one chocolate frog, you get a, uh, a wizard card as well. These come in both dark chocolate and milk chocolate. There's some really fun Hogshead merchandise. This says Hogshead at Hogsmeade, $17, but there's the Hogshead on the other side. So it is like dual-sided. That's pretty neat. And then over here you have an embroidered Hogshead adult baseball cap, $26 for that guy. And then right next door you can also get your Hogshead uh, little saucer here to actually put your cup on. These are $8 a piece for these coasters. For $40, they have some really fun new Lego offerings. Like this one over here is actually Hogwarts Moment. This is the potion class. They have Hogwarts Moments divination class and then transfiguration class. These are all $40 a piece. Here's what some of them actually look like inside. Like, again, the attention to detail on some of these Legos looks really amazing. Like over here, they're actually performing Wingardium Leviosa. For $25, they have some really nice women's bracelets. This is the Gryffindor one. You get three different uh, charms on there and they actually clip on, which is really neat. But you have your Gryffindor. Over here you have the uh, Slytherin. Then your uh, Ravenclaw and then Hufflepuff. And also check out these ones. Looks like you have multiple bracelets, about four of them. $37 for four, four different bracelets, which is a pretty darn good deal actually. Let's see, where Dwell, the uh, brave at heart oh that's really cool so they do have like little sayings there for each of the houses they also have some brand new pumpkin juice sippers it's a uh, free complimentary refill for the first one actually these remind me of the pumpkin juice you could actually purchase over in hogsmeade and diagon alley these are 15 dollars though and you do have to pay for extra refills after the first one that's a pretty darn good deal for those and check out these really large size honey dukes coffee mugs these are ginormous at 21 dollars a piece for 34 dollars you can get a really awesomely detailed uh, hogwarts christmas ornament you have all of hogwarts castle it says wizarding world of harry potter like those there are very very nice i also want to show you guys something simple but it's just perfect a great little take home it says wizarding world of harry potter on this coffee mug 17 dollars but it's actually perfect just the wizarding world of harry potter they also do have some awesome adult sweatshirts. This one has the Hufflepuff crest on the uh, heart section. It's 
says Hufflepuff down the side. Very, very soft. I strongly suggest you guys check these out if you're here in the parks. And they do have these in a kid's version. They look a little bit different. They actually have the, the uh, house crest there on the sleeve. It's embroidered Hufflepuff, but the kids' ones are $50 a piece. I had such a great time hanging out at Universal City Walk today. Like, I always love going in those stores. It reminds me of being at Disney Springs, where, like, you don't have to pay to park. Unless you come here really early, you do have to pay to park to come to City Walk. But you believe it's after, like, 6 p.m. or something like that. If you come to here, you can actually come park for free and then enjoy City Walk. Like, you don't need a park ticket to go to Islands of Adventure or the Universal side, which is really neat. Like, I love that you could just come, do some dining check out some of the awesome restaurants do all of your shopping because like the main universal store does have a lot of the merchandise that you'll find actually in both of the parks so it's kind of all collected in one and you don't need a park ticket which is really fun if you'd like to further support the channel please consider checking out our patreon page i'll let a link to that in the description box of this video but if you like today's video give it a big thumbs up and as always make today awesome